Alrighty, critters. Welcome to the life of Maurice. That is, this is my alternate channel. <clears throat> From this point forward, I'm going to separate any content that is not 3D printing related, and I'm going to put it here on this channel. Um, anything like this is literally going to be just like a life vlog kind of thing. Whatever I come up with, you know, reviews for some gadgets, you know, rocket flights, drone flights. Uh, fixing something in the house, um, getting the containers installed, which would be a video for today. I technically could be 3D printing related since it's going to be my workshop, but you get my point. The point is anything not directly 3D printing related will go here. Anything that is 3D printing related will go to my 3D printing channel, today's 3D print. I've heard people loud and clear and the metrics agree that mixing the content is not a good idea. It hurts. The channel to mix the content but there is a significant portion of people who want this content and I consider it fun so why not <laughs> so everything else you know from gadget reviews to riding my bike to fixing my house to cooking a meal whatever I whatever fancies me to publish a video for I will put here um, this way if people like that they can watch it here and they don't have to worry about getting notifications if they don't want to watch that on the other channel because the other channel will be just for 3D printing. Um, I guess that's basically it as an introduction. Uh, my name is Chris Taylor or online. People know me as Neris, N-E-R-Y-S. Uh, I actually got that from the Discovery Channel, not Star Trek. That actually came after. It was a name mentioned. Um, apparently, it's a it's sourced from both Ireland and Egypt, and um, I liked it, and I've used it ever since the early '90s, late '80s, to um, do anything with the internet online. You know, BBS days, even before internet, and so it's just stuck. So that's the etymology of that name. Um, needless to say, when I watched the first episode of Star Trek D Space Nine and Kira Neris came on, I was like, that's cool. <laughs> um, if you have any questions, as with my other channel, I love interacting with my critters, with my minions. So if you have any questions, always be welcome to ask below. I'm, for the most part, an open book. Um, I will make one unlisted video that I will link below this um, to describe my history, the past, and the problems I encountered to get to where I am, but that will be the only video where I will go over that content in any kind of detail because um, that's the past. Um, give you a really quick rundown. My father died. I got left with the bag for all of his debt. The city pulled some legal chicanery to force me to effectively inherit 100% of his debt. So I worked three full-time jobs, 120 hours a week. This channel partially saved my ass, my 3D printing channel. When I realized I could actually make an income from it, and I just did the best I could to make it through it. Sold the house, sold the business, paid off all the debt. I ended up with almost no money, but also debt-free. And let me tell you, debt-free is nice. Okay? I mean, I might be living in a, a one-and-a-half wide, apparently, one and a half wide trailer home, but it's my house on my own land. I have one, almost one and a half acres in a beautiful area of New Mexico that's absolutely gorgeous with so far I've met two of my neighbors and they both seem fantastic. Um, I, I hope I made the right choice. I think I did. And I think it can work out even if my channels fail and I can't earn a living strictly on my YouTube channels. I am now in an environment where even a part-time job can support me um, because my cost of living is so low. Um, you can watch that other video once I make it. Um, I don't really want to discuss that in future videos because that's downer information as far as I'm concerned. You can just reference that video. It's not made yet. I have to make it. And you can watch that anytime you want. If you want, and if you want to ask questions, ask on that video. Don't ask on other videos. I want to keep I want to try to keep everything else upbeat from this point forward because I feel good. I, I feel good about my prospects. I feel good mentally and physically that I think I can improve and, and work here. And it says tracking target loss, but there it is. It's got my face. <sighs> Laser targeting from the Osmo Pocket. It follows me. 
I love this little camera. I wish it came default with a little wider lens. But um, it's nice. It's a good little camera. Um, I can't think of anything else. I'm doing this off the cuff. I'm waiting for the guy to show up with the containers that I'm putting out back to form my workshop and storage space. Last night, I moved the bus over to the end, and I moved the trailer up front temporarily so that he is completely clear to drive into the back and drop off these containers. They're bringing them one at a time. They are hoping to bring two today. I shouldn't drift from the purpose of this video as an introduction. So I now live in Edgewood, New Mexico. I moved 2,100 miles from Levittown, Pennsylvania, which is 2,000 miles that way. Depends on which way you're facing. <laughs> East of where I currently sit. And um, go from there. So um, if you watch my Today's 3D Print channel, I have a series of four videos called my Insane Westward Move. You can watch those to see the move. And um, there's a couple of other videos on that channel regarding the old house and packing up and getting ready. So if you want to see some of that history... Just go to todays3dprint.com and you can watch that. The um, Ostensibly, the purpose of this channel is to post videos of whatever. I need to diversify my income source because my objective is to make a living as a content creator. To work from home, making my videos, and earn a living from doing that. To earn an honest income by doing that. To me, that is the... That's the closest a person like me is going to get to the American dream. To be able to wake up every morning knowing that I can do what I enjoy doing and earn an honest living from it. I don't have to screw anybody. I don't have to be a slave for anybody. I don't have to work a minimum wage job for anybody. I mean, I'll probably make about minimum wage, but minimum wage doing what I enjoy, I'm okay with that. As long as I, if I can get to the point where I'm not, you know, worried about how am I going to pay next month's bills. I'm okay with that. I estimate if I can get my income to around 1800 to 2000 a month, which is not a lot, that's basically poverty level, minimum wage, but if I can get my income level to that point, I'm okay. I, I, I will do okay. I mean, the cost of living here is very low. My taxes are 400 bucks a year versus the $8,300 a year back in Pennsylvania. Um, I will basically have, uh, what is it, one, two... Four utility bills, I have electric, water, I will have gas, and of course, internet. And we have our cell phones, of course. Although I just signed my sister up for Hello Mobile, uh, 25 bucks a month for unlimited. Um, yeah, <laughs> I think it's 15 gigabytes before they throttle you, but that's better than Boost, where she was only getting three gigabytes before she got throttled. And she averages around seven or eight gigabytes a month. I've been watching her data usage. Most of it's on Wi-Fi, so that's perfect. She's right in the middle range of what they give her, and so she doesn't have to worry about being throttled anymore, and I save 120 bucks a year. That's a win. <laughs> um, that's it. If you guys have any questions, if you want to see any particular kind of video, if it's 3D printing, it'll go on today's 3D print. If it's not 3D printing, it'll go here, Life of Nerys. And I will, I will have a domain name, lifeofnerys.com. I already got it. I just have to connect it to the channel. Um, so by the time many of you watch this, you'll probably be able to just go to lifeofnerys.com and it'll come right here. So how do I make income? Well, once I hit 1,000 subscribers here, I'll be able to monetize this channel. So I will get money from the views on this channel. Not much for a person at my level. Uh, like, for example, my Today's 3D Print has... 14 and a half thousand subscribers and I average about 2,000 views per video and I make about 100 bucks a month from AdSense. But hey, that's 100 bucks a month. You know, that, that pays for the internet. The internet's 100 bucks a month. Um, that's how much it costs to get gigabits. It's $111 a month. I then have what are called affiliate accounts. You can think of them as commission accounts. Um, you go into a Ford dealership and you buy a car the guy who sells you the car gets a commission for completing that sale. I get the same thing from my affiliate links. So if you go to Amazon and, you know, buy a knife or buy a radio using the link that I use to send you there, I earn a commission. Anywhere from 3 to 10%, depending on what it is. Um, so, you know, you buy one of these Baofeng radios and, you know, I'll make... 
three bucks. So hey, it works. It adds up. On my other channel, I make about between $400 and $800 a month on Amazon, um, which is a lifesaver. It works. I also have affiliate links to other providers. So if you buy something from eBay, I have an affiliate link. If you buy something from Walmart, I have an affiliate link. You know, any of the 3D printing companies or the gadget companies, Gearbest, Banggood, AliExpress, I make an income. Why am I telling you all this? Because I'm using the same philosophy for this channel as today's 3D print. Absolute transparency and honesty with my victims. I mean, my minions. <laughs> um, everybody's my victims except my viewers. You guys are my minions. You guys are my critter army. So you guys help me to earn a living and we have fun doing it. Um, I have a, a bit of a twisted sense of humor. You'll have to get used to that. <laughs> um, <laughs> hey, I've, I've been through hell. Have, have other people been through worse hells than me? Have other people, are other people living through worse hells than me right now? Yes, absolutely. I don't care. It's irrelevant. I, I wish the best for them, but my hell is the one that I have to actually live with. So just because someone has it worse than me doesn't make what I have good. It just makes what I have less bad than what they have. So there is always going to be somebody worse off than you or me or anybody else. No matter how bad it gets, there's always somebody who's living worse. That does not demean the hardship of whatever I live through or whatever you are living through. So um, I... Made it through a bit of a hell. My YouTube experience has helped pull me out of that hell um, financially. I would have lost the house in Pennsylvania if it wasn't for the YouTube channel. Um, so I want to be absolutely honest with my Minion Army and tell them exactly what I'm doing. If you guys ever have any questions about what I'm earning, what I'm making, I will tell you anytime you wish. I am basically an open book. You know, what goes on in my bedroom is a private space. Stay out. But everything else is an open book for you guys. So if you have any questions, ask away. Um, I want to make sure everybody understands that I'm being transparent and honest with you guys. So when you use those links to purchase stuff, you are helping me earn an income, and I appreciate that. If you want to support me directly, I have Patreon link down below. Patreon is basically monthly support. Um, I suggest... Um, more than one dollar because at one dollar they have to charge like 45 cents worth of fees because of the merchant fees for credit card companies um, but those fees are fixed it's like three percent plus a 40 or 50 cent fee so once you go above a buck it's still just about 45 cents um, if you um, if I do a live stream on this channel I don't know if I will I don't know if there's going to be any content that warrants a live stream um, but if I do, um, don't use YouTube's um, Super Chat because they take 30% uh, of the donation. If you go down below to my PayPal link, there I get like 97% of the donation. So if you give me, you know, 10 bucks on PayPal, I get $9.70 of it, $9.60 of it. If you give me 10 bucks on Super Chat, I get $7 because Super Chat takes three. I'm just explaining how that works. I can't think of anything else offhand. I do have, um, if you're interested in the place I moved to on today's 3D print, there are links to um, the walk around for the house and stuff like that um, when I first got here. Um, later on tonight or tomorrow, whenever I have time, I will make some um, links in the description down below to. Um, the relevant videos on today's 3D print so you don't have to search through the list. You know, I'll go right to the bus update videos, the move update videos, the house tour update videos, stuff like that. So if you're interested in that, you'll be able to go directly to it without having to watch the 3D printing stuff. If you're interested in the 3D printing stuff, subscribe to that too. Um, when I do a new video here, I'll let you know if I have a significant video there. And of course, if I do a video there, I'll let you guys know, hey, I have a video here too for those who aren't subscribed. I can't think of anything else offhand. I think I'm starting to ramble a little bit. That's kind of the way I do it. Um, that's it. If you think of anything else you would like to know that you think should be in an introductory video, uh, let me know. Um, that's it.
content. Um, enjoy the content if that's what you want. Um, if you want the 3D printing content, check that out. I appreciate whatever support I get from anybody. I appreciate you viewers asking questions and enjoying this interesting journey with me. <laughs> but um, I think it's going to work out. I mean, my gut says this is going to work. That I have a, well, that I have a chance, that I have a shot, that as long as I don't drop the ball, that as long as I, you know, get off all of my fat butt and do what I need to do, that I think this could work. I think we could make this happen. So, um, don't expect any kind of congruity in content. The content on this channel is going to be very random and very spur of the moment. Actually, I think my first video is going to be a, a mic spec video. <laughs> How to install one of these mica specs? They're one of my favorite little gizmos. Um, I just like them. I've purchased like 50 of these things because I use them for digital signage in the porno shop. Yeah, that's something you'll want to discover from the other channel. <laughs> um, yeah, my I'll explain all that in my history video if you want to watch that. I have to make that first. Um, that's it. This channel was originally going to be for the long form content. That's why the first four videos on this channel are big, long printer builds. Um, but then I discovered live streaming worked, and I didn't have to separate the long-form content from my channel. I can create short-form videos, and then I could do live streams for the long-form content, and they didn't conflict. There wasn't a problem. See, a channel that has both short and long-form content, the, the, the metrics say that doesn't work. And I have to obey the metrics. You remember, this is a business. The purpose of this is to earn an honest living doing what I enjoy doing. So that means that I have to treat this like a business or it's going to fail. Um, it's a personal business, but it's still a business. I have to treat it business-like or it's not going to work. Um, so I discovered that the live streaming worked and then I was able to do the live streaming. And so I stopped obviously posting long-form video here because it was there as live streams. So um, I will probably just delete those four videos in time. Um, they're just not needed. They're not needed here, unless you guys want me to leave them. If the consensus is you want me to leave them, I'll leave them. Uh, otherwise, I'll get rid of them just to keep the channel clean. Uh, I can't think of anything else offhand. I'm, I've been rambling on here for 16 minutes. <laughs> but um, I wanted to give you guys an intro of what's going on and what the purpose of this is and where it's going to go from here. And hopefully you guys will enjoy it. So... If you want to see some weird, boring, strange content from the life of a person, if you if you like that voyeuristic um, experience of just looking over the shoulder of a person on the internet, I'm your guy. You're going to get a lot of POV video. I got these wonderful little things. The, the very first pair of POV glasses I've ever gotten that actually record decent video, decent usable video. Um, it struggles a tiny bit in low light, but not bad. I mean, actually decent video uh, worth the price um, you'll be actually I'll be doing a video on these soon too I just didn't even think about that till now but yes I'll be doing a video on these because they're awesome <laughs> I got lucky they had one particular model that was on sale so I grabbed it and I'll make sure if you get these you buy them from Amazon because there are QC issues I had one pair where the video was very soft I'm guessing the lens assembly wasn't put together correctly well, mass produced in China the lowest common denominator. So I sent them back and got another pair, and it was fine. So I have two pair. I have one pair with clear lenses for indoor use and one pair with um, sunglass lenses for outdoor use. And um, I also found a company that might be able to make me prescription lenses for these, which would be awesome. So stick with for that too. You're gonna see a lot of gadget videos on this channel. I love gadgets. I just, I have a thing for gadgets. So you're gonna see a lot of that here. <laughs> Um, let me know if you guys want them as individual videos or if you want them as digests. So if you want like a short little five or six minute video of whatever current gadget I bought or made or if you would like me to wait until I have like two or three of them and put them together into one large like 15, 20 minute video. Whatever you guys like, whatever the metrics and my fans um, decide they like is what I'll do. So that's it. I'm rambling long enough. Um, later on this weekend I will make the history video so that if you're watching this at the very beginning, yeah, there's not going to be a link there for the history video. 
because I want to do it right, because I want to do it just once, because I don't want to dwell on the past. I don't want to dwell on the negative. I had a pretty rough go of it for the last three years. And um, I want to make that video one time. And I don't want to have to make it again, because I want to focus my energy on the future and on making my life good, not moaning and whining and you know, going, oh, woe is me in my past, so screw that. That past is 2,000 miles that way, and that's where it's going to stay. So you guys have a great day. Thank you for participating and watching me ramble on for 17 or 18 minutes. Um, enjoy. Ah, 21 minutes. I was looking at the wrong timer. Ha, ha, ha.